But if I tell you I'm no good, you know what I <laughs> All right, YouTube, what's up? This is Sebastian. I'm gonna be talking about hygiene. Everything you see here is not really on the expensive side for some people. I'm probably the most, like, $15. So I'm gonna get into that. So the first thing I'm gonna get into is, well, proper hygiene. Deodorant-wise, if you use female deodorant that's, like, very strong, scented female, and you don't like it, then I would recommend Pure Sport. And the travel size is pretty cheap and it lasts around a month and a half. Um, this has a very masculine scent. If you want to smell masculine, of course, go with this. These have more of a unisex scent, even not this one at all. These two have more of a unisex scent because it's more like a tropical scent. Now, if you're looking for something very, very masculine, Aqua Reef smells very masculine. But keep in mind, these are deodorants and this one's the antiperspirant and so is this one but um you can smell this one throughout the whole day like it'll stay on your armpit until you wash your armpit um this one is a very strong scent as well will stay throughout the whole day but it's also an antiperspirant with the deodorant so if you really want to smell masculine then i'd advise you to go with these two the good thing about all these deodorants is that they're pretty cheap i mean i think they're cheap depending on everybody's economical standing but like four dollars and 19 cents where i live i don't know if the prices vary where you guys live and this is a dollar and this one actually comes in a pack with like five or fifteen dollars so almost like three dollars each or so plus tax so all right so continuing with hygiene um, cologne plays a really big part two sprays and you're gonna smell nasty it's optional of course i mean it does help you pass because as soon as they smell this they most likely will refer to you as a male. This was around $13. Another thing you might want to look into is if you ever go to a department store or sign up online for like free samples for cologne. It's pretty good. And this is a really good brand. I bought this for free. And you can see, I because it doesn't have a spray for free. They, Imagine free, so if you want to invest in that. Clothing wise is really depending on the person you are. Like Kip said, like jeans, do hide your curves, or anything black really. So I wear a lot of sweat kind of stuff, like joggers and all that. But that's me personally. Because I know it'd be it's actually easier for those who have a smaller waist to find joggers than for those with the bigger waist like me. Uh, play t-shirts do help. Like I said, I wear a lot of graphic t-shirts, a lot of hoodies. I only wear, I only have two pairs of hats. I don't really wear hats because I usually put my hair on natural, but I decided to put a hat on since I'm going to be talking about clothing. Accessories don't really make a difference. Like, 20 or 50 bucks. I mean, if that's all you can afford, like black bands or unisex, you know, whatever you can. Converse, 40 bucks. Maybe you can get your hands on. Those will help you pass. Um, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope I wasn't too boring. Um, I'll leave links to my Tumblr, my Instagram, my kick. You know, if any of y'all need help out there, I might be thinking about doing a little package for some trans in need. I'll send cologne, sample colognes, stuff like that. So if you're interested in that, you know, kick me or DM me. So yeah, peace out.